What up all my fight fans? So there's been fight news talking, there's actually been recent news I should say, with Dimitri Bivol basically rejecting the fight with Canelo Alvarez. Basically saying how he doesn't want that fight. He feels like the same term, same everything isn't, uh isn't doable like he just doesn't want to do it like if he already beat him once in that same division in the same way he just does not want to do it again he wants to do it at 168 he wants to become the undisputed champion of the world where canelo on the other hand he doesn't want him to go down to 168 because he's gonna feel that if he beats uh dimitri Bivol at 168 that people are gonna say oh well you only beat him because he's at 168 he you did not beat him at 175 and that's what canelo wants canelo wants to fight him at 175 he wants everything to be the same he wants it to be uh for his championship belt obviously uh dimitri bovall's undisputed champ or not undisputed but his championship belt and he wants to show everybody that he can actually do it at 175 now of course it's a big ask not a lot of people are thinking that canelo Alvarez could do it it's very tough because Dimitri Bilbao is one hell of a tough fighter. He is definitely one hell of a tough fighter. He is not somebody to overlook. We saw what happened. Pretty much it was almost one-sided. Almost one-sided in that uh, that fight with Canelo. Canelo Alvarez had maybe a couple of rounds you could give him if you're being generous. But yeah, Dimitri Bilbao was just too strong, too powerful. He was able to walk through Canelo Alvarez's punches. He never really hurt him. So yeah, I mean, personally, I would prefer Canelo Alvarez to be at 168. No more flirting around at 175 because I feel like these guys are just too big for him. I feel like these guys are just way too big. And with their boxing, boxing, excuse me, boxing experience and their... Uh, their power and their weight and their strength it's just too much for canelo canelo has always been a smaller smaller fighter he's um i even felt like maybe he was a little bit too small for 168 that 160 would be a really good division but he's already shown us that being the undisputed champion at 168 he had no problem doing that fight he had no problem doing any fights at 168 100 so eh, i mean does he need to do the rematch? No. No. I mean, at the end of the day, sometimes you got to cut your loss. Sometimes you got to say, you know what? This guy's better than me at this division. Should he do it at 168 on um, Dimitri Bivol? No, I don't see the point of that. Because again, you're going to have these built-in excuses. You're going to have people going to say, well, the only reason he beat him was because he was at 168. Now, I know what a lot of people are going to say. They're going to say, oh, well, Canelo Alvarez is just afraid to put his balance on the line. And maybe so. Maybe so. He's not afraid, but maybe so. He just doesn't want to take that risk. Maybe he wants to become the uh, lightweight champion of the world. Just like he did against Sergey pa- uh, Sergey Kovalev, excuse me, Sergey Kovalev, like he did then. But at the end of the day, you got to remember, Canelo Alvarez is the ace out. Canelo Alvarez is the one that calls the shots. You know, against Dimitri Bivol isn't so interested in making the money. Dimitri Bivol isn't so interested in becoming, um, you know, making a big super super big fight. He's willing to take on against uh, Arthur Betterbeef, um, which is another great fight. I'll be very excited to see that fight too. But um, Again, Canelo Alvarez is the one that calls the shots. Just like Floyd Mayweather did. Floyd Mayweather, you know, I'm sure Canelo Alvarez wants to be at 154, but we remember Canelo, uh, excuse me, Floyd Mayweather wanted to be a little lower class. You know, we already knew Canelo, um, Canelo Alvarez was a big guy. He was 154. He never really fought under that weight division before. But, you know, Floyd Mayweather made him come down a little bit and made him dehydrate him a little bit. And pretty much there it is. It is what it is. So Floyd Mayweather called the shots, just like Canelo Alvarez. And Canelo Alvarez isn't making this guy go down to 168. He's making him fight him at that regular weight division. Like, hey, you know what? Let's do it then. And then who knows? Maybe Dimitri Bilbao beats him again. And then maybe one more time you get another shot at 168. You never know. Or the fact that maybe he actually does uh, beat Canelo Alvarez. Or excuse me, Canelo Alvarez does beat Dimitri Bilbao. Then we have ways of doing part three. And we can do part three at 168. You know, because basically Canelo Alvarez wants to be undisputed champion. He wants to bounce. He doesn't want to just fight anybody just to fight anybody. So, hey, you never know what's going to happen regarding that. Do you think Dimitri Bivol should take on that fight, should make that big money fight, should make a big name for himself and fight Canelo Alvarez at 175? Or should he just call it a day and move on? Let me know what you guys think in the comments regarding this whole situation. Like, subscribe, hit that notification button, and I'll see you guys in the next video.